hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new please subscribe please hit the like button and please hit the notification bell and guys you're more than welcome to leave comments below welcome to the crypto success youtube channel In this video guys, I would like to talk to you about two platforms. The one is called Coinless and the second one is called Republic. And the reason guys that I want to talk about these two platforms, these are some of the very few platforms left currently where you can participate in pre-sales or crowd sales or IDOs, whatever you want to call them, without owning tokens or without, you know, being on one of the tiers of the platforms so basically it's free you just have to register and you know it's not easy when i'm saying it's free to register and to get into the queue both of these platforms have a queue system it's free to register free to participate however not easy to get in because you know it's so popular that hundreds of thousands of people normally participate so guys without any further ado let's talk about these two platforms Now let's take Coinless first guys, if you click on my link in the description below and it's your first time, obviously you have to register, you click on get started, it will take you then to this page. What you then do guys, it's a normal registration, name, surname, email, passwords, they will then require you to do your KYC. Okay, so you then go ahead and do your KYC, you would need obviously passport, proof of residence and so on. But obviously guys, once you've done your KYC once, Coinless is an exchange, you're done. Okay, and you didn't just watch the, the website or the telegram, I believe they have a telegram and so on. And once they have the new pre-sales or crowd sales or IDOs, you then just register for the IDO. You don't register and do KYC again. Now guys, this is what the dashboard looks like and unfortunately I can't do a live one because they have my, you know, personal details all over the place. So I had to do screenshots for this one. If you, you know, go to the dashboard, you will see for example, Centrifuge is the current IDO or the next one that they will have. You can then just go ahead and click on Centrifuge, for example. It will take you to this screen. You can either click on register here, but maybe you want to first read up on the details. So you can go ahead, scroll down and, you know, read the options, the price, you know, the vesting periods and so on. And once you're happy, you can then you know, click on one of the options to register and let's assume you click on um, option number one, it will take you to this screen. Now guys, obviously I've registered already, but if you've not registered, it will say here in orange, I believe, um, you know, please register. Once you've done your KYC, the only thing you have to do is to click on your name, confirm which country you are from, and then they will say you have registered, okay? And that will take you about 30 seconds, okay? And that's why I'm saying it's worth your while. Another reason, guys, why I think it's worth your while considering, you know, coin list is the fact that you don't have to send your, your funds here if you did not get into the pre-sale. Now, guys, initially I thought that was the case with Mina Protocol, for example, about a month or so ago. And it cost me, you know, around about 50 USD to send the funds here and to send it back when I did not get in. However, my understanding is now, guys, that you can obviously register and you get into the queue and I'm going to show you how that works in a little bit. And if you get in, then you have another two days, I believe, to send your funds here. So how do you do it? Once, you, once you've been successful and you now need to send your money here, just go ahead and click on wallet and you click on deposit and guys i'm using usdc you can decide what you want to use i believe they have some options like ethereum usdt and so on to me it's just better to use usdc you go ahead and click on that and you click on this disclaimer you say that you understand and then guys they, they give you this address where you need to send it to okay and it's just a normal transaction you go to your metamask you insert this address there and you send and then obviously you will see your funds here mine took about 
30 minutes to arrive here so it's not that long and it's it's a very easy and simple process obviously guys when you want to send your money back and like i said i don't recommend that you send it here if you have not been successful but if you want to send it back you just click on withdraw and it'll take you through the process then Now guys, this is then the not so good part about CoinList. Unfortunately, it's very popular or fortunately, um, you know, it depends on which side of the coin you are on. This means that hundreds of thousands of people normally apply for these projects and they are using the queue system. So guys, on the day of the sale, you will then be required obviously to click on a link or to go to the website. There will be a link that will take you to the sale. And guys, please forgive my my images. I took them, you know, on with my cell phone on the day of the sale. Um, so it's a bit blurry. Be that as it may, guys. So I joined this particular sale, Covalent sale, two hours before the time. Okay. Now they say it doesn't matter when you join, you will be allocated a random number in the queue. So I joined two hours before the time and this is what the screen looked like and I waited. Um, this is some of the information that they show on the screen while you are waiting. You know, I waited some more, then there were 32 seconds left and look at this. <laughs> I was then in queue number 166,689. And guys, here's my tip. From what I understand, if you are not in the first 20 to 30,000 people, then um, you don't sit and wait. Okay, it'll take you hours to sit here. Okay. With my first one with Mina Protocol, I actually waited and waited and waited because I didn't know what was going on. So I learned with the second one that, you know, just wait until they give you your queue number. And if you are not in the first 20 to 30,000, that's it. Then, you know, you move on to the next one. Now, guys, like I said, um, I believe it's worth your while. Uh, you do your KYC once, like I said, and then you just register. It takes you 30 seconds to register whenever they have a new sale. And once you're in the queue if you're not in the first 20 to 30,000 then don't waste your time okay then you move on and you wait for the next one now let's move over to republic this is going to be a very quick presentation because i didn't get too far with the republic one but i'm going to share with you what i know up until now and you know once i'm i have better luck with republic i will do a full video now guys, with Republic, it works more or less the same. If it's your first time, you click on sign up and you have to do your registration and your KYC again, okay? So same thing, you need a passport, ID, you know, proof of residence and so on. But once you've registered, once your KYC has been approved, then that's done. Now guys, up until now, I'm only aware of one sale that they've had on Republic or I only tried to participate in one. It, it was called the Sierra Network sale. And Republic has the same queue system, okay? What is different with them is that they use the bit pay you know platform for their payments and guys i will do a video once i have more information on this but my understanding is also that you can just keep your funds on metamask if you get in they will obviously give you an address and i believe you can then just send it from your metamask i'm speaking under correction guys but uh, they they seem to be using the bitpay one as the main source of payment however i've been told that you can use metamask Now guys, the same thing with Republic, but a little bit different. You have to be on the Telegram group of the particular, you know, project. They will then give you a link. You click on that link and it will take you to this website. Okay, so here I believe you cannot join, go to the website an hour, two or three hours before the time. You have to wait for the link. And as you can see here, once I clicked on the link, I was in position number 31,516 and... 
Again, guys, this was my first one, so I waited. This is some of the information that they provide on the page while you are waiting. And then, guys, after some time, I found out that this, that they actually sold out quite quickly. Uh, unfortunately, they didn't inform us, so we waited in line for a while. And once everything was done, guys, as you can see here, only 2,419 people actually got into the sale. And I believe this took about you know, a few minutes. So the improvement here for Republic is, guys, once the sale is done, just inform everybody so that we know, then we don't have to sit in the queue. And as you can see, guys, I was in 31,516. So depending on the type of sale, guys, if you're probably not in the first 5,000 or so, then again, don't waste your time. You move on to the next one. But guys, I think also it's worth your while. Like I said, you will do your KYC once. It'll take you maybe an hour or so, maybe even less. Then you just register, you wait in the queue. If you're not, you know, in the first 5,000 or so, then you know this one is not for you and you move, move on to the next one. So guys, just in conclusion, I think that it's worth your while, you know, to register on Coinless and Republic, join the three sales and, you know, if you just get into one or two for the whole year, it might be absolutely worth your while. Hope you enjoyed the video on Coinless and Republic. That is all for me for today. Till next time, goodbye.